This video is about axioms for expected utility theory. In my discussion of rationality, I noted that in its most basic form, analysis of consumer choice rests on just two assumptions, completeness and transitivity. For decision-making under risk, we require two additional axioms of desirable behavior to develop a predictive or descriptive model. These additional axioms are continuity and independence. That gives us four axioms, completeness, transitivity, continuity, and independence. Under these axioms, a decision maker behaves as if choosing between risky prospects by selecting the one with the highest expected utility. The four axioms are often called the von neumann morgenstern axioms for a rational agent. This gives us another benchmark of rationality. An agent is rational if they conform with these four axioms. One important feature of preferences under these assumptions is that utility is cardinal. The magnitude, not just rank, of the numbers matters. If you look at other resources on the axioms underlying expected utility theory, you may come across an axiom called the Archimedean property. The Archimedean property is an alternative assumption to continuity. Only one of continuity or the Archimedean property need be assumed. I will not cover the Archimedean property in these notes. Beyond the axioms of completeness, transitivity, continuity and independence, some additional axioms are often adopted for practical purposes. These include using a reference point of zero wealth, non-satiation, monotonicity, convexity and diminishing marginal utility. In the following videos, I discuss each of the von neumann morgenstern axioms and the auxiliary axioms we use in examining decision-making under risk.